So today I look a little different. Might be a little crazy. You know, I got dandruff like. Bet y'all ain't know I ain't had no hair on the set. <laughs> so I'm looking real crazy today. <sighs> but I got like an interesting subject. But before I do my interesting subject, y'all, it's this song that I love to death. And I want, damn, it's hot in here. It's this song that I love to death. And I had to go down to the Penobscot building today. And this guy walked up to me and he was like, you so pretty. And he was just like, can I get your number? And I'm like, no, because mm, I don't even know my number. To be honest, I don't because I don't give it out. So I just don't know it. So we got the talking and it was nice. And he was like, you don't have no dude or nothing? And I was like, no, I don't have no dude. Like, he was like, but you deserve to be loved. But I'm like, but I'm okay without it. Like, I'm not one of them chicks that need to be loved. But anyway, we'll get to that later. I'll talk about my love life. But this song is like, it's not a black song. But just listen to it. While I eat my burger.
I like that song so much. But we are going to talk about the guy that I met today. That's what we all talk about. I need to turn this down. So. So. This guy asked me. He like. You deserve to be loved. And. It's like, you know what I'm saying? I think, like, when most dudes meet me, they think that I'm young. You know what I'm saying? Not realizing, like, I'm as old as I am. And I've been through a lot of shit. You know what I'm saying? I've been through a lot of shit. I'm not no young... I'm not no young girl that you could just run up on and just run some game on me. You know what I'm saying? That's not me. Like, you really got to be on top of your shit to talk with me. My hair looking, like, nappy as fuck man with all this goddamn danger you like really gotta be on top of it so you know like when a guy asks me do you have a boyfriend no i don't have a man and when they be like oh you why not because i don't want to deal with y'all bullshit my peacefulness my peacefulness is better than any relationship and then he said, well, you, you deserve love. You deserve to be loved. You deserve, you know what I'm saying? And I probably do. You know what I'm saying? I probably do. But I just don't, I'm okay. You know what I'm saying? I'm okay with, I'm okay with being by myself. You know, maybe some women, they don't want to be by themselves because they just want a man. Oh, my hair looks so crazy. Cause they just want a man i don't i'm okay by myself like your peacefulness i think people don't appreciate i see all this shit above my eyes i'm sorry y'all i people just don't like the 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 fact of being alone they don't like the aloneness you know they gotta have that some women my mom used to tell me some women like to have, like, they feel like a piece of man is better than no man. That's what my mom used to say, that women think. A piece of a man is better than no man. But for me, I don't need, I don't need to have a man. You know, I, I, I really don't. Like, I'm okay. I'm okay with being by myself. You know, like, and I asked this question on Facebook. I said, which is harder? Is a relationship harder or is a marriage harder? A lot of people got on there and they said that a marriage is harder. And I can understand, like, I, I just can't see how that could be possible. I don't see how that could be possible because in order for you to conduct a marriage, you have to learn how to conduct a relationship first. So I couldn't understand, like, it was a lot of people that said marriage is harder because you can't just walk away. But yes, you can. You could walk. It's a lot of people out here that don't have morals. So they'll walk away from marriage just like they'll walk away from a motherfucking um, relationship. Like, I don't think, I don't think a marriage, I don't think a marriage is, ugh. I'm sorry, y'all feel like I'm stripping. I don't feel like a marriage is is as hard as a relationship. You have to you have to be able to you have to be able to work through a relationship in even even order to start a marriage. If you can't maintain a relationship, I'm just trying to understand how do these people think that if you can't conduct a don't you do it don't you do it go in the house I'm sorry my little four year old just decided he just about to come outside and he ain't even got no coat on, no hat on. He bringing his bike outside. Like, I ain't tell you you could come outside. The, the, what in the hemoglobin hell is going on with these little five-year-old kids doing what the fuck they want to do? He want to see me fly out this window? I mean, this door? 
And see, that's another reason why I like enjoying being by myself because I have kids and I'm, I'm, I can't let nobody come in my household and say anything to my kids. And a lot of guys will disagree with me and they'll be like, see, that's why boys be growing up fags and this and that. No, boys be growing up fags because y'all motherfuckers be deadbeats and don't be watching y'all sons and the mamas take them around some perverted ass people and be molesting their ass when they was little. And that's how they turn out to be fags because they tamper with when they live because the mama take them around anybody i don't want anybody around my kid no that's another reason why i don't got a nigga everybody can't come around my motherfucking kid period my kids is like the jewel of my life i'm gonna protect them and guard them to no matter what so no i don't need no strange ass nigga coming around my kids trying to fuck i don't need that i don't need no man to take me out to dinner i could take myself out to dinner I don't, they like, you don't want to be loved. I'm loved by my children. This love out here, I'm not trying to knock it. I'm not trying to knock it. I'm not trying to bash it. I'm not a woman hater. I'm not scorned. I'm not bitter. I just know what I want and I know what I like. And to me, getting out here dating is a pain in the fucking ass. I know y'all probably looking like, wait a minute. She got a ring on her finger. No, this is from the video that I made before. I kept this bitch on and I never took it off. And I need to take it off because it'd be making my finger itch. But I just never took it off. But yeah, so the guy asked me what was my name. He wanted to get my number. And it's so crazy, y'all, because nowadays we don't know people's number because everything is through cell phone, cell phone, cell phone, cell phone. Yeah, I didn't even know. I I went to the friend of the court. I couldn't even put that. Excuse me. I couldn't even put down my. I couldn't even get on my cell phone number because I didn't know my number by heart. I do not know my number by heart. So the only thing that I could think of was to tell him my YouTube name, which is Rainy Blue Black. No, and do not open that door again. He is just persistent. On doing what he wants to do. <sighs> summertime is coming. Summertime is coming. So. The guy was like. I told the guy. I don't know my. I don't know my number by heart. Which I didn't. And he was an older gentleman. And he said. I said. But look me up on YouTube. On Randy Blue Black. I said. You know what? I block every day. Just to. Just to get something off my chest. Because I don't have a good support team to talk to. So I vent on here. And I get it off my chest. If it's on my mind. I cut on the camera. And I start talking about it. So that was, that's what was on my mind today. So I was. Just talking about it, talking about it. But yeah, I get that a lot. I get like a lot of guys to ask me, you know what I'm saying? Like, oh, you, you, your man so lucky. Huh. I you ask them that. If you I bet you if you ask any of them that, they gonna be like, hell no. Like, don't let looks deceive you. Don't let looks deceive you. Cause I might look nice and innocent and like, oh, she's so young and cute. I am a fucking firecracker. Like it took I go from zero to ten real quick. Real quick. Like some days I just don't want to be bothered. I would just like change my number and drop off the fucking just drop off from everybody motherfuckers be like damn well i did we will i was calling her but something happened i don't even talk to her no more i just be want to just get lost sometimes just like leave like just just like get a break take a time out from people i gotta take time out from people you know, I need that. I need that. Cause certain people, they really get to me and get you know, get to my nerves. So I be needing to time out. But this video 15 minutes long. So if I talk about something else, I hit y'all up.